Welcome back to episode, I think this is episode 11, of Marvel Midnight Suns. Oh, Deadpool stuff is available. Okay. Your story mission featuring Deadpool is now available on the mirror table. Deadpool's missions can be undertaken at any time without regard to the main story. Complete the first Deadpool mission and add him to the Midnight Suns roster. Hmm. Let's see. Hmm. So there's the story mission. The blades mission. A Carol mission. And a magic mission, as well as Deadpool. Description Mercenary Mutant Midnight Sun. New supernatural threat is rising. Better to face it than. Okay, well, anyone other than Deadpool. Still, he's handy in a fight, and he might have leads we could use. Making contact is a priority. Okay, I'll do this. Hmm. Actually, adding Deadpool to the team. Yeah, sure, I'll do the Deadpool stuff now. New York? Is there a problem? Another one? Central's picking up some unusual activity at the New York Museum of Art. <laughs> Looks like a break-in. It's all stolen artwork, recently recovered from the personal collection of... Deadpool? That Harlequin is an art thief? <laughs> uh, no. Red Skull is the art thief. Deadpool is more of a... kind of like... <laughs> you really need to see for yourself. <laughs> All right. Deadpool's hilarious. Okay, I only get these two. <laughs> Deadpool's wearing his mask, his savvy outfit, nice. That's locked. Deadpool the kid. Cowboy outfit. And X-Force. Hmm. Change outfits daily on. Cause I think I'll fit the theme of Deadpool would be fucking insane. Alright. Caretaker, are you sitting in with Carol? Oh, no. Not if Deadpool's involved. <laughs> you cannot be that bad. <laughs> Just wait. I will. Alright. Mystic in the warehouse. No candles. Whatever Hydra is looking for, 
It seems they have yet to find it. Just don't let them find you. We'll wait on that. Okay. You the new guy? Huh? Sorry, the new fully customizable heroically upgradable monster masher. Wisecracking anti-hero. Merc. Very occasional hero. Whatever. I'm adaptable. Spin me off. It's a big franchise. <laughs> Stop talking. <laughs> Are you here for the statue too? What statue? The one my very mysterious and very scary client from somewhere in very Eastern Europe wants me to steal back from the guy who stole it from him? It's the circle of crime. <laughs> that one? <laughs> Jimmy, my frickin' Chagas. They yeah. got Deadpool exactly <laughs> right. Hands up, hands down, ladies and gents. <laughs> This what? is a robbery! I'm sorry, have we met? Aren't you... Sloth? No, no, Sylvia. Cindy? Please kill him. Sin! That's it, of course, Sin! Granddaughter of Redhead. I mean Skull. I mean Skull. Whatever. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh my gosh. They got Deadpool exactly right. Have much luck with these stealth approaches. I have yet to participate in one that was actually quiet. <laughs> quiet is boring. I'm almost never quiet, and things go not terrible for me sometimes. All right. Try not to get wiped out by Hydra flunkies while you're mouthing off. Not dying is actually a key part of my strategy. <laughs> All right. Quick shot. Death from above. Red stacking bonus to Deadpool abilities. Lost armor. Okay. That once, centuries ago. Was something. Some for the rest of us. Okay. Yep, right. Yep. Oh, great. They 
cannot possibly match your strength. I hope you're keeping score at home. the hunter for Where one are they turn. hiding the clown car? I'd love to hear who hired you to steal that artifact if you're feeling chatty, and I know you are. Wait, you aren't the usual lady in my ear. <laughs> who is this? A uh, Carol Danvers? Why is that name so familiar? <sighs> I'm Captain Marvel. Ah, it's finally happening! Always happy to meet my fans. Tutorial hero combos are drawn in a hero combo card. Saying Chris from Abby on a hero hero com on hero combo card is added to the deck every time you enter combat. All right. One card. You! Two my cards. Kill. Weak, even for Hydra. <gasps> yeah, I can kill both. Of Guys, nice with extreme prejudice. Don't worry, they're just sleeping. Reinforcements incoming. 
that everyone? Your loyalty to the mother of demons will be your undoing. Sidekick. The advantage is mine. Okay. Insanely annoying, as expected, but at least he can fight. Step away from the artifact. Click! Did you just say click? Yes, I did. For emphasis. Now hand over the statue. Fool! Do you know what- ah, Monologue-free zone here. It's in my contract. Sorry. Now, respect the click and hand over the- Boom! Big click energy. I like it. Want to help me kill some Nazis? Hydra aren't Nazis. <laughs> ah, potato frittata. <laughs> what they have outlives their usefulness to me. Alright. Deadpool's just as crazy as I thought he'd I be. I had your back. Right. Where is Sin? In the statue? Oh. Hmm. The level designer says she went that way. <laughs> <laughs> Why betray her own people? Maybe she appreciates a plot twist? <laughs> you first. <laughs> Is this a mole man thing? Please let this be a mole man thing. You know, I'm the biggest Mole Man fan. Uh-oh. Vampires. Hex, Infect, Arrow Cards. Bleed damage. It seems Hydra and their mistress have escaped with the artifact. All right. Is this like one of those monkey's paw things? I say, mole man, and the universe gives us off-brand vampires? They're vampires with a Y. It's a whole... Ugh. Don't ask. Wasn't gonna. So, is there some special way to dust these critters? Beat them before they eat you? Bet you can't guess how many times I've heard that. All right. Too weak for this fight. Our play refunded.
Nice. All right. That's a lot of damage. I kill both these guys. Your mother abandoned. do is kill one of them. You need them. Technically, aren't these things his cousins? <laughs> no relation, as far as I know. Word of advice never suggest Blade is like other vampires. Oh, we met. He did not appreciate my humor. All these guys are one shots. Alright. Leave some for the rest of us. Oh crap. One of them just gained a health bar.
Bombers. Just for you! <laughs> Let that be a lesson to you, evil doer! First thing I should do is... Mama said knock you out! Alright. These vampires are a problem. At least we know how to handle them. That statue, not even a sparkly hole can cheer me up. Is this about your very scary client again? When he finds out how royally I botched this mission, or worse, when he finds me, I'll be... <laughs> Deader, Pool? There it is! You go, new guy! And by that, I still obviously mean the new fully customizable... Come back with us to the Abbey. No. The magical wards will protect you. No. <laughs> Help us track down Sin. No. <laughs> Fight off the vampire infestation. If you insist. Look, Ma, I'm gonna be DLC. <laughs> oh my gosh. Just the absolute best. And now we have Deadpool on the team. Uh, everybody's against it. Talk to Deadpool. There we go. Don't expect me to be happy about this because I'm not. All right. Can't customize stuff. Blade needs some time to come around to Deadpool. Give it a few years, Tops. Thanks again, Hunter. Thanks, Hunter. You're literally a lifesaver. I'll just lie low until my job is done. Does your job always require you to steal art? That's what the client wants, sure. Most of the time it's making people sleep forever. <laughs> a forbidden map, if you will. Mercenary work is a grab bag of awful stuff, and it rules. <laughs> uh. <laughs> it's a living. Well... It is certainly a way to make a life for yourself. That's ah, not all sunshine and kittens. Unless the job is at an animal shelter. <laughs> you hurt small creatures? No, I only hurt people. Puppies have never done anything wrong. <laughs> Hurting people does not bother you? I don't get paid to be bothered. I get paid to be cool and steal priceless artifacts. The statue being one of them? Stealing things isn't my usual jam, but money talks, and I sure love listening. Can you tell me more about the statue? Do I look like some sort of artsy-fartsy hipster to you? I'm wondering why it was important to you. Oh my gosh. Because looking at it made me feel all warm and fuzzy inside. If your client was paying you to steal the statue, it must be valuable. I'm not some TV game show host with a fabulous mustache. I don't get paid to ask questions. That does not sound very smart. <laughs> hey, I'll have you know my IQ <laughs> is average. <laughs> so, you will not tell me who you work for? Not unless I want to be on the receiving end of his punishment. Normally, I'd be into that, but he's too scary. 
Scary how? So scary that I took a magical portal to a stranger's house in order to stay away from him. You are welcome to stay at the Abbey for as long as you need. Forever. I'm gonna leave a Deadpool-sized impression on the couch. <laughs> That's where I'm headed, unless you still want my attention. Oh, yes. I have questions, if you do not mind. Sounds like somebody hasn't looked me up on the internet. Shoot. How come I have never seen you without the mask? It's physically glued to my face. If I try and remove it, my skin peels off like gum stuck on the bottom of a shoe. That sounds unpleasant. Eh, the mask helps hide what's going on under here. It ain't pretty, and I don't want to make people barf just by looking at me. That's not as fun. Or I can be honest and say there wasn't the budget for it. You pick whichever one sounds better. I find it hard to believe you're ugly. Hey, now, I never called myself ugly. This is to protect the softies who can't handle what peak male hotness looks like. <laughs> uh, your power. What is your special ability? I have not seen it yet. Just because I can't shoot lasers or pick up and yeet a bus doesn't mean my power is invisible. Wait, unless I can turn invisible now. Hold on, let me try. Nope. Still only got my super regeneration. Regeneration? You are able to heal quickly? My healing factor can basically bring me back from anything. No hand, no body, <laughs> no prob. My cells are always regenerated. That is incredible. Makes the life of a merc a lot easier when you literally can't die. <laughs> Sounds good on a business card, too. Oh my gosh. Can you tell me more about your katanas? Oh, the girls? I'm so glad you asked. They never get any attention. Guns are so impersonal. I like using the old hack and slash approach with these puppies. I also use swords. Using them takes much skill and strength. <laughs> I might not look at Hunter, but I'm a skilled as hell swordsman. We should dance sometime. <laughs> with our swords or with each other? Both. <laughs> Can you tell me about how you got the name Deadpool? My mouth is special, Hunter. I say all kinds of words with it. That's kind of my shtick. I do not understand. We all have mouths. What does it mean? It means I talk a lot. Hence, Merc with a mouth. I crack jokes and break the fourth wall so much that I may as well be the Kool-Aid man. <laughs> Who were you before becoming Deadpool? I was just a normal dude except I had terminal cancer. Then I went through an experiment that was supposed to cure me, but surprise, it didn't. Instead of dying, I got the diagnosis of living forever because of a big oopsie done by bad people who turned Wade Wilson into this guy. Wade Wilson? Oops, that's me. Well, before all that crap. <laughs> it sounds like you have dealt with a lot, Wade. Oh, don't even think about it. I have a badass superhero name for a reason. Before we came to the Abbey, you said you were going to be DLC. What does that mean? Deadpool living comfortably. But you know what it means. <laughs> what? What, what? Ugh. <laughs> uh. I misspoke. Talk later, Deadpool. Stringing me along? How cruel. <laughs> oh my gosh. Never changed him. <laughs> they nailed it perfectly. I'm tracking a new threat. What's ugly, hungry, and dead all over? Vampires. Yes, but an entirely new breed. Nothing I've seen before. Is it the kind that fused together, forming a grotesque bloodthirsty abomination? With arm length fangs and scales from multiple heads to toe? Like a blood sucking kaiju? That's a thing? It is a thing. Creepy. 
But this new breed is terrifying in a way that isn't so amalgamated. The new breed I'm tracking are, uh, they're vampires. I see. No, I do not. You already said they were vampires. Vampires with a Y? Pronounced exactly the same as vampires. I suppose that was wildly creative for the 16th century monks who first cataloged them. No, it is just confusing. That's why I'm calling them new breed vampires to set them apart. I'll flag anything related to these latest bloodsuckers and send it directly to the mirror table. Carol, you are... The best? Yeah, I know. So, the team encountered some new breed vampires up close. Your thoughts? As Nico says, I am not a fan. Right there with you. Sin's involvement concerns me. Same. I'm still not clear on why some Hydra forces left with her, and others served as vampire food. Agreed. Hydra is involved with the vampires. It is not yet clear how. <sighs> uh, don't worry. All right. I'm gathering all the intel you'll need. Soon enough, we'll kick the new breed back into whatever hell they crawled out of. What do we know about Sin? Apparently, she's a vampire. A vamp classic, not the new breed. That was news to me. Before that, S.H.I.E.L.D. knew her as a decently competent Hydra luminary. Sin always got a ton of leeway because she's Red Skull's grandkid. Hmm. Red Skull? The yin to Steve's yang. Founded Hydra, fought on the wrong side of World War II, and had a nasty itch for world domination. Do you think Sin could be working for my mother? She and Faustus used to fight like a sack of rats. Whatever her game is, Hydra as a whole doesn't seem to be a part of it. How do classic vampires differ from new breed vampires? These Zoomer vampires are more outgoing. They hunt in packs and don't seem to care if anyone notices them. They have similar weaknesses, sunlight still kills them, but not everything lines up. No need to invite them in, they're happy to smash through the door. Oh, and while they don't turn people into vampires, they can infect classic vampires who then serve as portable hemolisks for the new breed. Okay. Thanks, Carol. Sure thing. Thanks, Carol. Catch you later. I wanted to talk to Blade, but it seems like that's... Oh, Hunt. there he is. Can I talk to you? Can't hurt to warm up on Hydra's flunkies. You've got an endless supply of practice dummies to beat on. All right. That is a lot of room upgrades. And customization. Hmm. 
and Nothing different from the defaults. And it doesn't seem like there's anything different from the default there. Alright. Oops, sleep. And then continue with the regular main story. Back again. Safety's on, don't worry. I think. I'm gonna need a back rub. Somehow, hmm. Hmm. I've just got to truck down where Bleed is. Can I do anything with this? What can we work on for you, Hunter? Oh, I thought I had research that I could do for a second. Dang it. I don't have any artifacts that I can How's study. it going, boss? Ah, uh, uh, not bad, right? by one. Hmm. Upgrade all cards in your hand until they are played or discarded. Hunter takes 39 damage. Okay. So, I'm going to get Magazine Dump and Barn Bands of Fire. Until next time. sleep well. Oh, sure. I can pass out just about anywhere. Well, I hope the Abbey starts to feel like home for you soon. You know what they say, home is where the unresolved childhood trauma is. I'm sure you've got plenty of that. <laughs> Everyone has scars from their youth. I am no different. Being here doesn't cause you to... No, oh, I don't know. Dissociate? What is that? When you take a break from reality and shut the brain off, you should try it sometime. <laughs> no, 
Despite some unpleasant memories, I am still quite fond of the Abbey. Ooh, someone should really write a case study about you. Don't worry about me, I love weird. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to explore all of the Abbey's nooks and crannies in great detail. Hey, that's what I've been doing. Hey, can I ask a favor? All right. Hmm. Before all these new people showed up, I do not think I've... Well, it's so different. <laughs> No, oh, I see how some look at me like I am scary or weird. Hmm. I can either get the six friendship and three dark balance or th eleven attack essence. I'm gonna take Thanks, the Hunter. attack essence for the upgrades. Right, so they're chilling. Can I talk to them? Hi, hi, Hunter. Uh. What's up, Hunter? Yeah, I can talk to them, but it doesn't seem like they have anything to say. So, where is Blade? Over there. Ah, there's Blade. Blade, can we speak in private? Is it about the chore wheel? Because I'm not swapping. No, it is not about that. Good. Everyone knows how I feel about dish duty. Nico needs help prepping for a magic surprise party. No. Hell no. <laughs> I thought you were close with magic. I am. That's why I won't do it. I told Nico and I'll tell you. Magic skims the last chapter of a mystery before starting the book. The woman does not like surprises. And... why? Do you know why she dislikes surprises? Does she need a reason? That's how she is. And should I... It sounds like she would want her? to know about the party. Might not go over well with Nico. But magic would appreciate it. That's your call. Hmm. Is there anyone else who could help prep for the party? Outside the Midnight Suns? That Parker kid has way too much energy. May as well put it to good use. Thanks, Blade. For what? Kid's annoying. You'd be doing me a favor by keeping him off my back. Do half vampires need sunblock? Can your fangs drain a cream filled cake? If we bite each other, would we have the same powers? <laughs> it just... it never ends. Uh, Alright. Oh, come on, you were just there. Alright, now I gotta track down Spider-Man. Blade's there. Hola! I got tracked on Spider-Man. Why, hello, Hunter. Hmm. Hey. All right. Where is Spider-Man? There he is. What's shaking, Bacon? Do you have time to speak in private? Are you firing me? Am I getting fired? No. Why would you ask that? I don't know. I panicked. Uh, sure. Let's talk. Nico needs help prepping for Magic Surprise Party. Really? She asked for me? Um, not... Directly. Her hands are full, so I am delegating. Sure. I'm the new guy. I get it. How can I pitch in? She needs help decorating the party room. I can tape balloons to the ceiling while standing on it. I am so in. 
Alright. I could get rid of the... Where is... Because... Hmm. Eh. They're close to the same thing. Oh my gosh, I've been recording for almost an hour. I go on and on about not wanting to have very long episodes because it takes forever for them to render. And then... Ugh. Ready to work? Ooh, upgrade abilities. Oh. Uh, wait, reduces the cost? Not everyone wants my advice, but they're gonna uh, get in the way. Yeah, I'm going to upgrade that and heal. New and improve. Training level 3. Sliders steal increased damage in combat. And strange... Alright. Well, I'm going to end this episode here. I uh, hope everyone enjoyed, all of you enjoyed, and see you all in the next episode of Deadpool Takes Over the Video. Or maybe not. I guess we'll see.